bala bara kosa ta brande bala kosa ta yaraba inside and outside can you lift your hands to the one you came to meet the king of glory jada bakora sabra da gade bala de mo jata ka para da bala da bakora sabra gade bala go ahead and bless him in other tongues Jede bako pras kata braga de bala de bako so braga de bala de rabo. Rekata braga de bala de bako. Sha braga de bala de bako. Sha braga de bala de bako. Mighty God, Mighty God. Liba shata la baka prada gade bala de mo. Zete kate bala de baka de braga de bala de bako. Zete kapara de bala de baka sa braga de bala de mo. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the King of Glory. Lord, we bless you. Thank you for your glorious presence in this place. For there is nothing we can do without you. We are not ashamed to declare how helpless we are, except by your Spirit. It will only take your Spirit to bless your people tonight. It will only take your power to set the captives free, to heal and to deliver. We worship you in the beauty of your holiness. You are the great and awesome God, fearful in praises, doing wonders in the midst of your people. We give you praise. We give you glory. From everlasting to everlasting, Thou art God. For Your manifest presence in our midst, we give You praise. Lord, we bless You. Do what only You can do tonight. Let burdens be lifted. Let every sick body be healed. Let the oppressed be delivered. Let chains fall tonight. Let there be restoration. Let there be breakthroughs unlimited. Let the hungry find you tonight. Set men like the foxes of Samson on fire tonight. Do it for your glory. Thank you, Holy Spirit. In one minute, can you just tell the Lord why you are here tonight? Say, Father, I have come. I won't go back the way I came. Refuse it. Those of you outside, wherever you are, I'd like you to reach out. And say, Lord, I came all the way. I will not go back the same way. For he has not called the seed of Jacob to seek him in vain. <laughs> Oh, tonight is a feast. There are all kinds of things available. We are in the presence of the living God. Where there are angels all around. Your kind of presence is here. Your presence to heal, your presence to change. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hosanna to the Lord Most High. 
Oh, his presence is in this place, mighty. You will not be disappointed tonight because the king is in the midst of his people. Your majesty. It's a privilege and an honor to serve you, your majesty. You are in the midst of your people to do us good.
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are in for an experience tonight, I assure you. God will surprise you. presence is here, Lord. The presence of the mighty one is in the midst of his people. Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We truly honor you, your excellency. It is because of you that we are in this place.
Lamb of God, we worship you, Lamb of God, we worship you, Lamb of God, we worship you. Your holy name, sing your praises forever. I forget not your vanity. Bless your holy name, sing your praises forever. And forget not your vanity. How can I forget, Lord? Your benefit. 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 I want to welcome everyone to our miracle service for the month of May. We give God all the praise, to Him be all the glory in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to welcome as many who have come from different parts of this nation. Thank you so much for the sacrifice. We have people coming from different states. Only the Spirit of God is able to bring people. You are here for an experience tonight. The Lord will not disappoint you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Can you walk up to 20 people? Give them a big hug inside and outside. Twenty people. Those outside, we are watching. Are you greeting one another? Greet your friends, greet your enemies. Some of you are very antisocial. We are saying greet one another. You are just smiling at you and the only person you came with. Hallelujah. Give the Lord a shout of praise. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Wow. I think we should appreciate those outside. Those outside, they didn't do it well. Appreciate yourselves. Hallelujah. The devil is in trouble tonight. The devil is in trouble tonight. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. The devil is in trouble tonight. The devil is in trouble tonight. Tonight, your destiny will open up. No devil will hold you down. I tell you, I tell you, it's a new season. Yes, we believe. 
Holy Spirit, we give you all the praise for your majestic presence in this place. Forget about your neighbor. Face outside, forget about your neighbor. You are in the presence of the living God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus. Something special. about your name Jesus something happens when I mention your name Jesus something special about your name just for 10 minutes and we'll be up Mambo Sataka Kaya I tell you the power of God is everywhere Mamzeta Paladaba Kuriada Baladaba Wherever you are whether you are inside or outside I like you to know that the Lord is in this place whether you are sitting on the fence wherever the Bible says, now the Lord is that spirit. Where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. There is a name that is above every other name. There is a name that is above HIV, above cancer, above hepatitis, above barrenness, above stagnation, above every kind of challenge. There is a name wherefore God had so highly exalted him and given him that name that at the mention of the name of Jesus every knee shall bow of things in heaven of things in the earth which includes cancer HIV every kind of satanic infection every kind of molestation for this purpose was the son of god made manifest that he may destroy the works of the enemy hallelujah welcome to koinonia
verse 27. Isaiah 10, verse 27. And it shall come to pass. In that miracle service. That his burden shall be taken away from off thy shoulder. And the yoke from off your neck. And the yoke shall be destroyed. Because of the anointing. of power that your faith will not rest upon the wisdom Sophia of man but upon the power of God this is what you have come to encounter there is a sweet anointing in the sanctuary there is For in the sanctuary, God is here. Listen, I'm ministering to your spirit. There is a sweet anointing in the sanctuary. There is a stillness in the atmosphere. 
Oh, come lay down the burdens you have carried. For in this sanctuary, tonight, listen, this is the place where you can lay down whatever burden you have carried because his anointing is in this place this is not a psychology center where we do human therapy no this is the place where the spirit of God finds residence in the midst of his people and his power is here to heal his power is here to deliver listen let me tell you something is the devil's objective everybody listen is the devil's objective to make sure that he oppresses mankind the bible says in john 10 10 the thief everybody say the thief say one more time the thief commit not that means you will never see satan except he's coming to do one of these three things to steal to kill and to destroy steal stream kills colorful destinies destroys lives but jesus said i am come not to start a religion not to start a movement i am come that he may have life and that life to have it more abundantly the bible says he gave us of his spirit that spirit of adoption that brings us calling many sons into glory and now in him we can live in the reality of this life there is a realm above and beyond sickness there is a realm above and beyond the reach of satan our goal tonight is not just to heal the sick and set the captives free but to join hands with you to lift you above and beyond the realm that you were operating in before you came thou art worthy El Shaddai help me drama strong and mighty we praise Jehovah I am that I am You are the most high Every time we gather like this hovering around this entire congregation is that blessed spirit of God the one who can see the needs of everybody it is not given to me to see the needs of everybody there are some of you who are coming here with doctor's report they've concluded on your case but who shall say a thing and it will come to pass when the lord has not declared it and tonight i want you to know that your doctor's report is only one of the many available reports ah there are many other reports and the bible says whose report will you There are many of us that your situations and circumstances have spoken to you. It may be your friends. It may be your failures of the past. It may be your mistakes of the past. But my Bible tells me, remember not the former things, nor consider the things of old. For behold, I do a new thing. Jesus died for only three days. After three days, people were still talking about his death, whereas he had resurrected and was doing great things. He only died for three days. He didn't die forever. Is there hope for a tree though it be cut down? This is the message for some of you. He said, at the scent of water, who has concluded about your destiny, my brother and my sister? I've come tonight to tell you like the dry bones of Ezekiel. He says, son of man, can these bones live again? Son of man, can these bones live? 
can these bones of shattered dreams live again can these bones of a seemingly wasted destiny live again and they concluded and named him Jabez because his mother bore him in sorrow but a time came when Jabez was angry he said oh that thou wouldest bless me in Judges chapter 6 there was a man called Gideon of the Midianites the least in his house and his clan being the least the Bible says he was hiding and an angel appears to him and does not call him by his presence it's in the character of God to name things call things that be not he said oh thou mighty man of failure in other words do you not realize that there is a prophetic destiny although you are hiding but in the realm of the spirit this is the destiny apportioned for you tonight dry bones will come alive because you see Paul speaking said there are many voices in the earth many of you have heard the voices that are in your media no jobs no marriages statistics that have no head and tail that scare people the meltdown in the economy death and terrorism everywhere these are voices attempting to contend against the truth of God's word but the Bible says the weapons of our warfare are not carnal they are mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds casting down every imagination doesn't matter where it came from and every high thing that exalts itself above the knowledge of Christ is a bringing every thought the word bringing there is compelling every thought to come to the obedience of Christ there is a plot against the body of Christ every believers life is under attack the gates of hell launching their best arsenal in this season to try to cripple the prophetic destiny you hear stories of great men falling like a leaf generals and champions this is the plot of the devil trying to cripple families to cripple their finances cripple their health heterogeneous sicknesses that have no head and tail but the bible says in psalm 66 verse 3 how awe inspiring are your ways it said through the greatness of thy power shall thy enemies submit themselves oh they can submit they can submit through the greatness of thy power what affliction did you come here with some of you are here with terminal diseases they say you are ss and your genotype will not change some of you are here trusting god for life partners and marriages that devil that appears in our media and everything that discourages people there are many of us who are just tired of our lives you came here to attempt to find out if there is anything more about your life some of us are here diagnosed of hiv and the doctors have told you you know that there is no cure you're already counting your days have you not read in your Bible that the age of the least among them will be like the age of a tree? There are some of you standing for your family members. There are thousands of people all over the world streaming online, connecting with your faith. Let me tell you something. God is too serious to joke with your destiny. Did you hear what I'm saying? There are some of you because of your past mistakes. Many things have happened around your life. Son of man, can these bones live? Can these bones live?
There are some of us here, inside and outside, the testimony of your life is ichabod. You were once men and women on fire, especially for us, the sisters. And you got into all kinds of distractions. Let no one condemn you. There is a bomb in Gilead tonight. Some of you have all kinds of curses and traces of darkness. You run to men of God and they give you useless explanations. Nobody in your family gets married. Nobody in your family starts a project and completes it. In fact, you are the only one who was able to make it to the university. The Bible says the children shall not suffer the iniquities of their parents. Is someone listening to me? There are some of you, there are deaths. Deaths in your family. It looks like there are certain wicked, demonic cycles that happen. Hallelujah. Some of you are brilliant. You wrote your jam by yourself. Wrote Wayek by yourself. You got into the university and your story changed. You will read as if you will die and enter the exam hall and everything will blank out. Tonight that devil is a liar. Hallelujah. Tonight we are going to destroy everything that needs to be destroyed. Rebuild everything that needs to be rebuilt. Let your faith just be open tonight. Refuse to be a spectator. Refuse. Don't, don't, no, refuse. Don't say I will clap for other people. No. You can't, some of you are standing. You don't have a seat. Refuse it. The Bible says when Jesus saw their faith, faith can be seen. When Jesus saw their faith, they needed to meet him. The crowd was there. They taught the thing. They said we will negotiate with the owner of the house after I receive the miracle. Tonight is the time when you will forget about your neighbor. If it's your withhold, remove it and keep it. Hallelujah. I came here angry in my spirit because the Lord showed me certain issues that have been buffeting the lives of people that he must answer to the anointing tonight. I tell you, it must answer to the anointing tonight. There are some of you seated here listen to me you are the only hope of your family you know i'm not lying you may be the least everybody has failed they are depending on you and the same hand that brought them down is now trying to bring you down the mistake the devil made tonight was to allow you arrive this ground safely hallelujah Moses didn't need to tell people he had been with God. When he came out of that place, the Bible says his face began to glow. When Jesus was born, the Bible says suddenly in the atmosphere, a particular star began to shine. And that star started attracting the people who were relevant in his destiny. The Magi, all of these people began to come and they gave him gifts of gold, frankincense and myrrh. What has covered your glory tonight? It will answer to the anointing of the spirit. I tell you from the depth of my heart, I'm not motivating you. It will answer to the anointing of the spirit. You are not as bad as people say you are. The devil has given you an identity that not, does not belong to you. And he showed me Joshua the high priest. Although he was a high priest, he was wearing a garment that was not his own. And the Lord says, Satan, the Lord rebuke you. Is this not a reed that I've taken out of the fire? He said, remove that old garment. Many of you will receive tonight a garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness whoever has said over his dead body for you to move forward will get what he said hallelujah this is
is the goal of the miracle service it's not a time of teaching and discussion we have three weeks when we sit on the word tonight is the time when we demonstrate to principalities and powers that jesus died and on the third day he arose victorious as king of kings and lord of lords the bible says the earth is the lord and the fullness thereof the walls the systems and they that dwell therein belongs to him hallelujah and for many of you that demonic manifestation that makes you to run away from god there are many of you listening to me you are where you are because of the stubbornness of your heart every time you see true believers you laugh at them and you mock them but see the way your life is nose diving tonight is the time when you will make it right i know that there are people here pastors of different ministries that came from different ministries some of you are quietly seated outside you came to catch this fire gone are the days of monopoly of ministry where men sit down and brag over nonsense tonight i assure you that some of you will be lit like the foxes that samuel lit that that, that samson lit and you will run to the camp of the philistines and burn down everything that is not of god for the bible says whatever tree that has not been planted by god shall be uprooted there are some of you that god needs to open the financial destiny of your families because they have been closed your father is walking your mother is walking you are walking but there's nothing to show forth for it the bible says and in that day they shall no longer use this proverb in israel a time will come and tonight is that time this old proverb that has been used about your family it was said of nathaniel can anything good come out of nazareth the bible says he uses the foolish things the things that makes no sense hallelujah tonight some of you will encounter the favor of god very few people really know what the favor of God is all about. 430 years, Pharaoh vowed not to let the nation of Israel go. But in 24 hours, he didn't let them go. He restored to them through favor. The, the Bible says they spoiled the Egyptians without war. You can spoil a man without fighting. He said they got not into the land by their own sword neither did their hands save them but your right hand because you have shown them favor who are thou mountain before god's people tonight say who are thou mountain the hand of zerubbabel i'm speaking to families that are suffering without explanation the hand of zerubbabel that began this work that same hand will complete it listen to me let's get who the enemy is here very clear before we start look up the enemy is not your grandmother in the village stop wasting your time the bible has told you straight to the point we wrestle not against say one more time we wrestle not against so don't come here expecting we're going to just talk about your grandmother and grandfather uh -uh. they are only mediums that are being used if at all they are being used the real enemy is satan when they planted wheat the bible says in the night while men slept satan came and planted tears when the lord said he didn't say a wicked he said the enemy has done this the accuser of the brethren and tonight that devil will give way we are not confused about who is going to bow tonight are you hearing me the devil will not confuse us no we are not confused about the person who will bow tonight i'm preparing your spirit so that faith will rise 
don't be distracted listen let me tell you what demon spirits do in meetings like this when the word begins to come and you are receiving it especially for those of you outside who don't have a seat we get spirits through friends and people who just came to make noise and let me tell you there is a crowd here if you come to steal anybody's property i'm saying it now even if it's a pin you carry i tell you you will carry a curse upon your life and go back with it this is not the place to come and steal are you listening to me because i'm aware that not everybody in this crowd seriously came for koinonia if you see a pin on the ground leave it there come and receive your miracle and find your way home hallelujah say jesus is lord those outside i tell you do you know that as i stand here i sense the pool of faith from those outside i guess it's because they don't have the convenience of those i mean it from the depth of my heart i know it when i know it when the spirit of faith is upon the people i'm not saying you don't have faith hallelujah and jacob held on to him in the night this is what some of you need to do listen before i pray for you you have a role to play tonight the bible says jacob wrestled with god he said god if i perish let me perish you will not come and go back you know there was a time that the lord appeared in a place and he said the lord was in this place and i knew not so when he came again he said i know now you won't go back and the bible says he wrestled with him until it was getting to morning he said what is your name tonight somebody somebody's name your identity will change in the spirit yes 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 it will change it will change the woman with the issue of blood do you know first she was unclean she wasn't supposed to be among the congregation and she said look i don't care which rule i will break when i receive the miracle i'll go to the sanhedrin and all the people and apologize but for now for 12 years finish all our money doctors and she said if i may but touch tonight someone will need to say lord my seatmate will not distract me your weapon, your suit whether you have a chair to sit down or not say lord you will do something in my life let me share with you a testimony and then we'll begin to pray years ago reinhard bonke came to joss and i left zaria here and i ran to joss there were crowds of people hallelujah and while he was ministering i was lost in that crowd but i said god you must do something in my life for six hours i was standing on that ground there's no hope of going out except they will stampede you and you die for nothing you must stay there till they share the grace hallelujah i came by three in the afternoon and i asked the people i told them i want to walk i must do something they said no they trained the people i said train fire train or no training i must do something in this place i cannot see an anointing like this and waste it many of you lose value listen it's not enough to believe in god you must believe in the vessels that he's using i know ministers have exaggerated this and turned it into idolatry but it is important that you believe in the vessels that god will use hallelujah and Renard Bonke, I was helping people. I saw people on wheelchairs. While they were wheeling them, I said, please, can I help you? I said, Lord, one day this will happen in my meeting. I saw sick people. I was pushing them. The remaining people were doing work for a crusade. I was connecting with an anointing to change my destiny. Hallelujah. When he finished ministry, a pregnant woman was near me so the woman had to be leaning on me my legs were shaking i said leg if you are tired you can go home but for me 
I'm standing on this ground. Something happened. When Reinhard Bonke finished preaching, he wanted to take water. Suddenly, for the first time, I saw the visible manifestation of the Holy Ghost. I saw a bed that was bigger than this building hovering around the entire hundreds of thousands of people. It had silvery linings like this on the wings. I thought other people were seeing it. And suddenly I remember that saying, Elijah and Elijah, he said, if you can see, if you can see, if you can see, hear me? Many people are going to be watching miracles and testimonies, but there are a few people here God brought you to see. Because you see, many people just watch. No, 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 but people can look, others see. The Bible says, why we look not at the things that are seen, but the things that are unseen. There are unseen things happening. And I tell you, not everybody, but some people will carry some anointings. You will be shocked to leave this meeting and you will find yourself reproducing everything that you are seeing. This is not for everybody. But there are people that came here with genuine hunger. Hallelujah. Tonight, be ready to forgive everybody. I know there are whole families in this place who have fought and turned themselves into pieces. I said, let's come for Koinonia and find out who is the witch this night once and for all. None of you is the witch. The real enemy is Satan. So don't come here with a mindset to report another person. No. No. Are you listening to me? Destinies that have been tied down will be released. Oh yes. Rise up on your feet. In one minute, I'd like you to pray violently. Say, Lord, now is my time. Now is my time. In one minute, I'd like you to pray. Inside and outside. Now is my time. Lord, do not pass me by. I can't go back with this terminal disease. My marital destiny must open up. My ministerial destiny must open up. That barrenness must leave my life. Pray. Pray. The Lord is in this place. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, I see the angels of the Lord. Every time the Lord opens my eyes to begin to see his angels. It's time for deliverance and emancipation. Whatever has held you bound, it's time for it to answer to the anointing. It will answer tonight. It will answer tonight. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are going to challenge principalities and powers. 
spiritual forces of wickedness listen 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 the devil that is behind the predicaments of your life will be exposed and destroyed tonight are you listening to me let your faith be open because I see the angels of the Lord with swords of fire hallelujah lift up your hands everybody inside and outside I'm about to pray I'm about to pray we have been raised up with Christ and made to sit above thrones dominion and every name that is named not only in this world but in the world to come hallelujah oh my god the power of god is amazing in this place please ushers get set when you have the people let them come to front now we are going to shout the name of jesus once i like you to shout it with all your heart the moment that happens i tell you it's like a tornado the fire of God will sweep across this building inside and outside there will be massive deliverance especially outside all the people let me have them here are you ready now that name demons bow at that name are you ready now at the count of three one two three Satan be lost every demon every demon come out come out we expose we expose principalities powers shake it outside the fire of God is falling outside. Shake it, 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 shake Set on fire, be set on fire. Get on second day. Lift up your heads, oh ye gates. Lift up your heads, oh ye gates. Lift up your heads, oh ye gates. Oh, the legate, 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 legate. Outside, shaka, da, 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 Every demon power holding anyone captive, release them. Shaka da 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 da. Shaka da 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 da. Outside the fire of God, there are angels moving with swords of fire outside. I expose the powers of darkness. Every spirit. Be cast out. Come out. Come out. Hear my voice. Hallelujah. Those outside alone, lift your hands. Your destiny must change tonight. Those outside, at the count of three, I like you to shout the name of Jesus at the count of three doors outside because there are many of you that need massive deliverance upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance and holiness and the sons of Jacob shall possess their possessions are you ready those outside one two three Let the power of the Holy Ghost move outside. Let the power of the Holy Ghost 
fall like the dew of heaven. Let the power of the Holy Ghost fall. 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 Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Shake it. Rebeke Tori Kete, Le Koto Soso Koto, Le Kepariata Bariega Telebo, Mambre Koto Sepe Kerebo. Sheke Sheke Preke de Benedos. The power of God is still falling. Bring her here. You are going now. You are going now. You are going now. In the name of the Lord Jesus. The fire of the Holy Ghost on you. Come out now. Go out now. Out. Leave her. Let her go. Go. Now. The fire of the Holy Ghost is against you. Shekata bareke talikaba. Zendebra kalibratu kaprosa. The fire of the Holy Ghost upon you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Bring them, please. The power of God is still falling on people. In the mighty name of Jesus. Bring them. Come out of her in the name of Jesus. Out of her right now. Out. Go out. Go out. The mighty name of Jesus. You are going now. Keta ta rekata zezeke parita ramboso preketa liyaba rakapros kosopati le grete karia ta rataria ta bata pros kata liyaba bende pros kosoto tobari karia karaba shkebregele balaba the fire of God from your head to your toe let the fire consume you right now right now. The power of God is still falling on people. You will not escape. You will not escape. The angels of God are moving around the crowd. Bring that lady. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at my eyes. spirit in the mighty name of Jesus Christ do you know this lady has been under heavy demonic influence nothing is moving in her life now you just think the problem of this lady what she needs is counseling this is not counseling this is not about counseling the power of God is still falling on people the works of darkness will be exposed and you will see the way your life will begin to This is where light and darkness meets. One must bow. Hold on. Do you know what happened to this lady? And this is a warning to many of you. Sometimes when these demon spirits are under fire, they leave but they wait. You go back into the things you used to do, they will re-enter. When a spirit is, leaves a man, the Bible says, he goes through. This is why 
deliverance without a thorough growth and the teaching of the word is only a waste Chiefs and aprons, nothing special about this. I just want to teach you, especially for our students' school of ministry. Watch what will happen. This is an ordinary handkerchief. What makes it extraordinary? The anointing of the Holy Spirit. The anointing. Watch this. This is a lady under the influence of demons. She's not even looking at me. Leave her alone. Just leave her. Just leave her. You don't need to touch her. The anointing is upon her. Just watch what will happen. Go, go. Leave her right now. You're a wicked spirit. The mighty name of Jesus, the fire of the Holy Ghost is against you. Out of her now. Out of her right now. There's still one more person outside. Bring her. There's still one more person outside. Come out of her right now. Devil of darkness. Out. those in front here we have to hurry up they know time at all all those in front here i'm going to count three yeah i'm here one person outside in fact two not just one two two outside two outside two outside violently under the influence of demons because I saw the angels of the Lord gathered around that person oh salvation has come to this family there's one more person outside no escaping hallelujah yeah i've seen the poor eyes that's the person count of three bring this lady we will shout for your glory look at me look at me the mighty name of Jesus look at me your time is over in this body the fire of the Holy Ghost is against you Come out of her right now. Come out. Come out. Come out right now. We will shout for you. Out. Go. Out. 
Go, go. You are going. Hallelujah. See how demon spirits can be powerful. Look at how many people are trying to handle one person. This is somebody that this guy alone will lift. You are going in the name of Jesus. This is Koinonia. Jesus is Lord here. Bring the lady. Okay. You go and wait there. Just leave her. She will move Bring this lady. Come. Bring her. Bring her. Bring her. For light and darkness cannot stand. Your time is over. He makes his angels. Listen to what he's saying. Did you hear what he's saying? This is how you just sit down. One day you just hear that somebody just died. They say, how can I lie? She no, take the mic. We don't have all of that time. We're trying to do other things. Come out of her right now. Come out. Come out right now. Come out in the name of Jesus. That's how you see one day this innocent lady will just something accident or one kind of thing that has no head and tail. Come out in the name of Jesus. The fire of the Holy Ghost is against you. Shakata kata baladaba. Rakata ta 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 ta. This is what happens in the realm of the spirit when you pray in tongues. You have the opportunity to see it now. Come out. You are bound, rebuked. You are going. The anointing of the Holy Ghost is against you. You are going out of her now. Come out. Come out. Fire against you. Fire in the name of Jesus. Come out. Come out right now. Out of her. Out of her right now. Leave her. She can't hold me. She can't touch me. Don't worry. It's the fire. She will touch fire. No matter how mad a madman is, he can't hold fire. Out. Out in the mighty name of Jesus with a loud shout you are going go go you must go I set you free now no hiding no hiding I set you free Ushers, ushers, leave her. All of you leave her. Leave her alone. Leave her alone. Just leave her alone. Leave her alone. You will not cross that building. You will come back. Just leave her alone. You will not cross that building. You will come back. Just leave her alone. Leave her alone. Let her cross. You will see the demonstration of power tonight. Paul said, when I came to you, I didn't come. Just, just leave her alone. She can't go out. No, there are angels that back up the words of leave her. No usher should hold her. No usher should hold her. She will come back here by the force of the Holy Ghost. No usher should hold her. Don't touch her. Don't touch her. The light shines in the darkness. Just leave her alone. She will run and come by the power of the Holy Ghost. 
there is an agency of the spirit that compels things to happen oh she will come she will come it's by the power of the holy ghost whatever it takes that's how powerful the word of god is how all inspiring are your ways through the greatness of thy power shall thy enemies submit themselves you don't need to cover her she will move the influence of the holy spirit will drag her to the front here the influence she will run under the power of the holy ghost is under the power many of you don't know who the holy ghost is the holy ghost is not an angel the holy ghost is god hallelujah 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 don't worry <laughs> you will see wonders tonight the demonstration of spirit that word will not return back until she comes this is how this is what happens when you pray when you speak words god is showing you this is called signs and wonders they are supposed to encourage you you are not just watching movie hallelujah please we have to hurry up there are many other things to do peptic ulcer lift your hands peptic ulcer peptic ulcer you will see how powerless satan is just leave her she must come Peptic ulcer inside and outside. Lift your hands. It's time for you to be healed. Peptic ulcer. In the name of the Lord Jesus. I command peptic ulcer. Go. Go. In the mighty name of Jesus. Peptic ulcer. Be healed. Now check yourselves. Check yourselves. Listen. Bring this lady. Sister, look at me. As we worship you, let all the world come and see how the mercy we receive from you can set me free. As we worship you, let all this joy that fills our heart bring a hunger and a hope to those. As we bow in adoration and stand in reverence, show your majesty and glory as your anointing fall. As we declare your name, Lord Jesus, as the only name who saves, let the power of your salvation fill you. Heart, we pray. Hallelujah. Now, Hallelujah. There is a lady, one of your ear is not working properly. One of your ear is not working, it's like water or something.
It started happening a while ago. Please, who is that person? Come out quickly. Hallelujah. Now, I want to rebuke every kind of lump. Every kind of lump. Breast, lump in your breast, your neck, wherever. Is the lady here? Come. Where is, which is the ear? This one. You believe God can heal? You believe he will heal? Of course he will. Everybody watch a miracle. A power that is in the name of the resurrected Christ. Look at me. Look at me. Just look at me. Look at me. That devil of darkness. Go! Close the one that is holding. Right here, one ear just open. Look at me. Who knows you with this condition? Your brother. Is he here? Is he here? Call him because I know there are all kinds of cynical people who are here and think that it's stage one. If you can act this kind of drama, come and act. Where is what's the name of your brother? Victor, where are you? Run out. Victor, your sister has this problem. Now talk to her. Ask him. She couldn't hear with one ear. Look at the miracle. Rejoice. God bless you, my dear. Don't let them go. I'm seeing a cat. A cat. Come out. Come out! This is what I'm seeing. They are just trying to make it look like they are gone so that you quietly walk back. This is a cat I'm seeing. It's, I'm not even seeing a human being. I'm seeing a cat. Look at the... You see the way she's positioned? It's not normal. Now in the name of Jesus, the fire of the Holy Ghost is against you. All over your body now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Shata kata. Rekete pareketa. Shopeketa. Mareketa. Come out of her. Come out of her. Come out. Come out. Now devil. A cat. Come out. Go, go, go. You are going right now. In the name of Jesus. Go. Jesus name. Hallelujah. Now, all those, listen. All those who are outside Zaria, who came with sick people, Please come forward quickly outside Zaria please if you are in Zaria we will minister to you all those outside Zaria who are sick find your way to the front now quickly please let's save time let's save time whether inside or outside you are sick or you came with a sick person outside Zaria come quickly please quick 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 save time Jesus is in this place Doing wonders. Where are you coming from, my dear? Come. I'm coming from Kaduna South. Who is this? Kill her by September. They said they will kill her by September. Yes, sir. Hold it first. Hallelujah. Please come quickly. HIV, get ready. You came here with any HIV virus, get set to wait. Bye bye. It's going to go. Mama, who brought Mama? Please, if you came with any, who, who brought Mama? What's wrong with her? Uh, she's tormented with dead spirit. With what? Dead spirit. Dead spirit? Yes, for how, five years. How do you, what, I don't, do I understand what you say? Spirit of death. Yes. How do you know a spirit of death? Because she died. That's what they said. 
Does she speak in your house? Which one? Mama? Interpreter, Selena. Please come quickly, quickly. Let's save time. Tell her to narrate to us what is what's her problem. of Jesus Christ thou devil of darkness spirit of death go out of this woman right now tell her she'll feel something moving around her leg to her chest in the name of Jesus let that fire run through your body and set you free tell her her legs will be strong now and the sickness will leave I bring you life and I set you free stand up tell her to stand up Tell her to stand up. Tell her, let's walk. Tell her to follow me. Mama, so keep in it. So keep in it, So, I quit. So, you mama. So, you keep in it. Yaka, yaka, yaka. Like, yeah. How is she feeling now? I just got here. I see him. Look at this. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord perfects her in the name of Jesus. What's wrong with you? Who brought you? You came by yourself. Ah, please, you won't allow a little girl to come like this without you. Please, next time, if you're bringing somebody, let's know what come comes with that. Look at me. You speak English? How are you? What's wrong with you? Stomach. Your stomach. What's wrong with your stomach? It's paining you since when? Since on Saturday. You love Jesus. You believe you heal you. Alright, say after me, Jesus. Thank you for your healing. Say, Jesus. I believe in your power. Alright, watch what's happening to you now. Out. Jesus, she's free. Please give. I have a dislocation. Dislocation. We need to start. You know, I said this doctors. I think we need volunteer doctors. Eh? Who is a doctor, or at least in 500 level? Or 600 level for God's sake. Okay, Holy Spirit help us. You said you have a dislocation where? My thoracic lumbar spine. Due to thoracic thoracic lumbar, spine. lumbar spine. It's part of the body. That's the most important thing. Where is it, my dear? No, 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 no. You don't need to open it. Okay. You believe Jesus will heal you right now? Do you believe it? What couldn't you do before? Like what? Give me one example. Just give me one. 
if you are healed now you have a lumbar corset right now wait without the lumbar corset you cannot move but you feel pain that devil is a liar huh? are you ready to remove the lumbar corset Doctor or a brother, eh? 600 level. Are you a doctor now? What will stop me from graduating? Come, Janessa. So, explain to us what does this really happen? What, why? Yeah, this location. Lumba, what? On the thoracic lumba spine. Thoracic lumba spine at the vertebrae. That's the thoracic and the lumba vertebrae. Okay. Along the spinal cord. So, it has a dislocation there. What does it do? Any dislocation there. Why didn't you study medicine? Leave it alone. Any, All right. Any location there will make her not to bend properly. Okay. Might also make her not to walk properly. But she's using a lumbar corset now. Okay, she's using a corset. That corset is used to also correct the dislocation. Okay. That is that is medically using it. There. How long does it take to correct medically? Um, it could take three months. Okay. Or sometimes six months. Okay. Almost two years. You have been using for almost two years. That devil is a liar. Look at me. name of Jesus. You feel the power of God go through your body. You sense something flowing through your body. The mighty name of Jesus. The mighty name of Jesus. The mighty name of Jesus. Look at me, sister. What's happening to you? What do you feel happening to you? Everything happening to you. You're healed. You can't remove it. You are afraid. Like, why not? If you don't really mean to it here. A female, low female, if you're a male, go out of that place. Remove it and come. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What am I seeing with the eyes? There's somebody you are not seeing well. You are not seeing well with your eyes. Hey, God help us. Your eyes. If, if your only, it's a serious problem. This is not the only person. Your eyes. You. What's this? My sister. She's afflicted with uh, all diagnosis. What is this? of Jesus partial or total blindness be gone be gone right now every spirit responsible you will live by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus Christ put down your hands check yourself check yourself check yourself any improvement check yourself check yourself any improvement what couldn't you see before? You couldn't see far. Like where? Still you are seeing well now. Still blood. It's still blood. What of you? You can see the time now. What is the time? Sister, come. The lady with the lumbar corset. Follow me. Let's walk. Let's walk. Come. Let's walk. Bring the corset. Lift it up. Come. That devil is a liar. How do you feel here? You feel any improvement? Come, let's go. Come, walk as fast as you can. Would you bend down before? Try bending down now. Just bend down. Up, up, down. 
up, down, up, up, come, come up. Can you, can you try jumping? Do this. Look at this. Something's moving, something's changing. Look at, look at this. This is a miracle. Something's moving. This is what she brought that she was using. That devil is a liar. Something's moving. Seas blowing. Sister, you are healed and healed forever. That devil is a liar. In the name of Jesus. My dear, could you see this time before? Okay, look at me. Come. Look at the time. What is the time? Nine minutes past nine. Ten minutes past nine. Could you see that before? No, sir. Absolute healing. Thank you, Lord Jesus. What again? Look at that. There is. Okay, well, you've seen the time. There's a writing there. Can you try to read it? That writing. Try. See mine. Uh huh. You can't see it very well. Okay. Don't worry about the ones that are written in cursive. Can you see the one down? Am I taller than you? Come, come up. All right. See it now. Let me see what you can read. One to read. Just try to read. Don't don't be afraid. Don't worry. We'll pray for you. You are going. You can't stand. It's the fire of the Holy Ghost correcting her eyes. In the name of Jesus. Let us stand up and check. Okay, let me pray for you very quickly. Anyone with HIV inside or outside, please come out quickly. Don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed. HIV, quickly. HIV. Please come. We have to hurry up because the ministers must come. Up. Okay. There are lots of things we need to do. HIV. Please don't be ashamed. This is a family. Nobody knows you. Come and take your healing and go back. You can stand for somebody too. Go. We didn't say you are the one who has the AIDS. You can stand for somebody. Abba. Whenever you come for Koinonia, listen, let me tell you something. Don't just come. This is a family. This is not a church. Please, HIV, quickly. Either you have HIV or you are standing for someone. It doesn't matter. Quickly, HIV, HIV. Whether for yourself, I'm not going to ask you, it doesn't matter, please. This is past nine. We have to rush because everybody here must go back with a testimony in the name of Jesus. Now, I'm going to lay hands on you. Whether you have it or you are standing in for someone, it doesn't matter. Ask them to go back and go for a check.
HIV be healed now. 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 HIV go. You are the devil go. HIV be gone. Be gone. Make sure you go for your test. Be gone. Go. Go. Come out of her. Come out of her. Out of her right now. Come out of her. Come out of her right now. Go. Be gone in the name of Jesus. HIV be gone. For yourself and for the people you are standing for. Come sweet heart. Be gone in the name of Jesus. Be gone in the name of Jesus. Be gone in the name of Jesus. Shabaka Taratariada. Rakate Balakoso Pregadibash. Be gone in the name of Jesus. Go. 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 Leave it right now in the name of Jesus. what your sickness is please come out right now we'll minister with the ministers you're sick you came here with any sickness please come out no matter where you are just come just come just come outside or inside come and stand quickly please please hurry up just spread yourselves around no matter how many you are we will wait no matter how many this is a miracle service just line yourself line yourself pastor jakes bishop Pastor Williams, please go back. Quickly, quickly. Quickly, everybody. If there is no space, stand. We must pray for you. Can go back to the way you left for me. Hallelujah. Let me tell you something. Even if you are at second equa, still come. Don't let the devil stop you. We came here for you. If there is no space, stand there. As they are praying for others, if you are here, go back to your seat. If you are outside, ushers help them. They take this home. Listen, listen. As hands come on you, while you are here, be praying. Are you listening to me? The moment hands are laid on you, some of you demons will come out. Some of you, you will be healed. When that happens, as you walk back to your seat, check yourself. Sorry, we don't have time to be taking testimonies. The time is not enough. Hallelujah. One day we'll try and make miracle service a night vigil in Jesus' name. So that we can have time to minister. Hallelujah. We're going to pray for you. Hallelujah. We have the one-time president of FCS before in our midst. Pastor Kenny, please celebrate him. Sir, please, you can come and join us. Hallelujah. You can come and join us as we pray. Hallelujah. Please, spread yourselves. Don't just come and say, it's me you want to talk. It doesn't matter who touches you. I tell you, while you are here, if I were you, don't just stand watching. Uh -uh. Say, Lord, this is it, oh. This is it. I came for my healing. I came for my deliverance. And that must happen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Worshippers, are you ready? Please, let the atmosphere be charged. Those of you who are sitting, make sure you are praying and connect. You may not be sick in your body, but there are areas of your life. Just be patient and let us minister. In Jesus' name, sir. Go, go. Go, go. 
go. In the name of Jesus, your healing comes wherever you're standing for. It's done in Jesus' name. Okay. As we pray for you, please just go back. It's the power of God. Heal. Heal. Lumps will disappear. Lumps will disappear. Lumps will disappear. Lumps will disappear. Jesus. Shataka baladabakari. Go. You're healed. Let the river flow. Let the river flow. Go, be healed. And refresh my soul. Come out, come out, come out. Fire upon you. Shake la barata kariata. Let the river flow. The fire of the Holy Ghost is in this place. Be healed. It doesn't matter what the sickness is. Fire. Shake karia. So peleta, so peleta, shut up, and refresh my soul. Say, Lord, let the river flow. Heal. Only as I pray for you, heal in the water of life. Heal. His presence is in this place. Revive us, refresh us. This is the place of healing. Let Seda come and say, healing. Out. 
Jesus, 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 I say my heart to sing. Lord, the name I call you, Jesus. I call you, Jesus. I call you, Jesus. My heart to sing. Lord, the name. Jesus, 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 my heart to sing. There is no other name. I call you Jesus. I call you Jesus. My heart to sing. No other name. No other name. No other name. Come out of her. This is where light stands against darkness. Look at me. Look at me. Just look at me. Look at me. Come out of her. He made her to break her hand. This evil spirit 
that hand is getting healed come out come out
of her now. Come out of her now. Come out of her now in the name of Jesus. What kind of noisy demons? These days, demons are becoming so noisy. Go, go. Because we didn't release this girl, she has been lying down here. Can you imagine? shoes of fire. Don't worry. Just hold it. It will burn you for nothing. Don't worry. He makes his angels spirits and his ministers. Everything you touch is fire. It burns you. So bekete zindo tole kariata. Where's the other person I'm looking for? Come back now, now. It will burn you. This fire will burn you. You don't know what you are looking at. Come back. Why did you hold my legs? She can't cross. Don't worry. There are angels. She will come back with the same speed she went under the influence of the spirit. It's time for you to go. In the name of Jesus. Don't worry, everybody, we are going to pray. Just be patient. Everyone, just leave her alone. She will come. It's the force of the Holy Ghost. It will pick her from where she is and she will come. The same thing happened to this lady. This is not trial and error. This is the spirit at work. This is not about displaying jamboree. No, we are very serious people. Just leave her. She can't stand up from here. Ushers, don't worry. Leave her, leave her. She can't stand up. She will not be able to stand up from here. Stand up if you can. Just stand up if you can. If you can stand up, stand up. We have to hurry up. This thing's waste. Just leave her, leave her. She can't stand up. No. Impossible. Did you bring your prayer requests? Prayer request. Everybody pass your prayer request to the person at the last, at the end. Please, let's hurry up quickly. Come back here. Come back here. Just leave her. Come, come and stand here. Now come and stand here. Come and stand here. Please pass your prayer request quickly. Come out now. Come out of her. Pass, pass your prayer request. 
please hurry up pass your prayer request Everybody stand up. Stand up, please, inside and outside. Ushers, hurry up, please. If you have not written those on Facebook and those on the internet, all those streaming online, please, they can be part of it. We have a God that answers prayers. Hurry up, hurry up, ushers. If you've not written, just scramble it quickly. Please, one minute. You can see that we're out of time. Honestly, the time is, is just not enough. But God is faithful. God will still do what he will do. Are there ushers helping out? Who is here to? A miracle walker. You are a miracle walker. That is a glorious God. That is you are a miracle, miracle walker. Please quickly. Glorious God, a miracle worker. God is a glorious God. Now, the revelation behind writing prayer requests, listen, please, and bringing it here. The Bible says in the days of Hezekiah that they wrote a letter, there was a situation that threatened him. And the Bible says he took it to the temple before the altar and he laid it before God and told God what it was and God solved the problem. So that's the spiritual revelation behind what you are doing. Hallelujah. Let me invite the minister, sir. We have a God that answers prayers. Pastor, sir. As we pray on this, I'd like you to stretch your hands. If you are outside, just stretch your hands to the screen. If you are outside, stretch your hands to the screen. We have received countless testimonies. Please, ushers, if there are still people, very quickly, very quickly. Those online, let them know that we are with them in the spirit. Everyone begin to pray in tongues. Everyone begin to pray in tongues. Shebrekete kala bara da 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 ba. Shabrata kala bara da bara da ba. Rakata prakata bara da ba. Shabrata kata prakata prakata. 
Lord, solve problems, break burdens in the name of Jesus upon this altar. We present this before you. Turn these prayer points to testimonies, O oh God. Lord, move on behalf of your people from all over the nations and online. There are people trusting you for miracles. Lord Jesus, honor these requests by the power of the Holy Ghost. Let there be miracles, oh God, for the sake of your son Jesus. You have made this place a place of sign and wonders. Father, in the name of Jesus, we we'll call for miracle jobs. We cause doors to be open in the name of Jesus. We bring healing and deliverance to families. Let every financial breakthroughs in the name of Jesus. We call for health in the name of Jesus. Every high blood pressure case goes down. Those that trust in God to heal the needs of their loved ones, their mothers specifically. The Lord touches them in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The Lord brings a breakthrough to your academics in the name of Jesus. For every prayer point here, the breath of God goes upon it in the name of Jesus. We release healings from the four corners of the earth. Breakthroughs and blessings. Miracles, miracles, miracles. Let the windows of heaven be opened in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, we give you praise, we give you glory in the name of Jesus. We pray. Give Jesus praise for this request. Everybody stand up as I prophesy to you. Hallelujah. The Bible says, can these bones live again? He said, only down the west. I tell you, this whole miracle service, this is the part that I love best. Where we begin, because this is where the creative power of God moves in like an arrow to just meet situations. Hallelujah. As I make these prophetic declarations under the anointing, I'd like you to shout, Amen. Amen means let it be so. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you ready? Those outside, make sure you participate. All of you lift your hands above your head. Say, believe in the Lord and you shall be established. Believe his prophets and you shall prosper. Lord, I come as only one sent. With no ability of myself. I command right now every door that is closed over your destiny let it be open right now 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 Every closed door, I command it, be open right now. Every situation in your life that is more than your ability, you have prayed, you have fasted. Tonight, in the name of Jesus, I command those mountains, be level right now. Be level right now. Be level right now. Be level right now. Every yoke of bondage over any family here. I'm speaking to families right now. Because I see ancient doors with chains. Right now, 
every chain over every family wherever they are in the name of Jesus chains be broken 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 hallelujah every yoke and every cause of poverty oh you need to lift your hands for this over your life your loved ones and your family every chain of financial bondage under this anointing tonight that yoke be broken in the name of Jesus financial doors open financial doors open financial doors open doors of contracts doors of opportunities doors of breakthrough doors of breakthrough financial doors no power will stop you no demon will stop it hallelujah can I prophesy to students here lift your hands every curse every ordinance he told Job he said in six things shall you be delivered yes seven things one of it is the scorching of the tongues every curse of mental blockage the power of God will fall on a lot of people on this every cause shatter -ta -ta -ta. be free be free be free I release you from academic prisons come out of academic prisons come out of academic prisons come out come out come out the cause of carryovers the cause of carryovers let it be broken now let it be broken now Higher. I tell you mighty things are happening inside and outside all those long overdue for admission whatever is holding you shatter I cause it right now in the name of Jesus final year students do we have final year students here In the name that is above all names every Pharaoh that said you will not graduate this night I prophesy to you these Egyptians you see today you will see them no more forever we graduate you in this place we change policies in faculties in departments emergency meetings be held for your sake let causes be waived in the name of Jesus anyone's script that is missing in this place any missing script the Bible says and the donkey of Kish the father of Saul was missing the Bible says the prophet told Saul he said go back for the ass has been found I prophesy to you that script be found now let the angels of restoration go to every department every faculty
Alléluia. Alléluia. The Bible says, and Elijah told Ahas, saddle your ass and run for I hear my spirit, the sound of the abundance of rain. And the Bible says, Elijah had gone ahead of Elijah. Elijah seemed to be retrogressing. And then he kept praying. The Bible says, suddenly, the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah. He guarded his loins and used his feet. I command, right now, shata kata. You will run like Elijah. Let the hand of God come upon you. In 2013, run like Elijah. Run like Elijah. Run like Elijah. Restoration. Restoration. Advancement. Restoration. Advancement. Hallelujah. There is a blood of darkness. Listen. Over vessels that carry the anointing of God. The rate at which anointed men are compromising on spiritual things. From immorality to all kinds of case of scandal. Especially immorality. This is an ongoing plot. Because every time you represent something to the body. The devil will try to make you a victim of your message. Right now I pray. Katabalataria. And the sons of Issachar had an understanding of the times. This is a plot. Some of you are already falling victims of it. You carry ladies to your room and you are laughing. You are just sitting there. You are dressing loosely and carelessly. They are also dressing loosely and carelessly. And you are laughing. You don't know it's a plot to throw you. He says she has cast down many. Yea, mighty men have been thrown by her. He said her ways are the ways of death. Lift your hands. That spirit that wants to throw mighty men, I put a seal of the blood upon you. It will pass over you. I command that devil of immorality and for married people, adultery and unfaithfulness. I curse it right now in the name of Jesus. Let the spirit of genuine holiness return to the body. He said, for who shall ascend to the hill of the Lord? And who shall stand? Listen, young men, let me warn you. Be careful. Any man can fall at any level. Don't let the devil deceive you. Some of you are already becoming careless with your life because of little anointing here. Don't let any mentor or father or anybody deceive you. You must maintain a heart of inadequacy before God. The moment you sense that every time I go to God, I cry. I say, Lord, is it is there seed of lust in my life? Or I don't say I'm an apostle or man of God. If let me tell you, the Bible says, He who hides his sins will not prosper. Many of you don't know the reason why some people rise in anointing. Later they just keep quiet. It always starts in the secret. But whatever is happening in the secret will not stand for too long. It must be. Samson slept with Delilah. Who knew? But one day his eyes came out and it was a sign. I pray. I pray. Some of you who have been taught messages that are not consistent. I'm not condemning your church. But there is a plot to dethrone mighty men. Mighty men are falling like chickens. We do not condemn them, but you must be warned. Are you listening to me? Say in the name of Jesus, I receive the spirit of holiness, the spirit of purity. I mortify my body, Shatakapa, as an instrument of righteousness. Sin cannot have power over my body every habit in this place masturbation pornography what again reading 
useless magazines that don't have the word of God don't say it does not matter let me tell you ungodly music that does not carry the presence of God right now in the name of Jesus that appetite I take it out of your life forever I take it out of your life forever ladies only ladies lift your hands any guy who is already in your life or is about to come to your life and is a plot of darkness to rob you of your prophetic death bring that lady because that's her problem that's the spirit speaking bring that lady right now in the name of Jesus I break that relationship from the realm of the spirit that guy will leave this girl I break it from the realm of the spirit I break it right now from the realm of the spirit in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus Christ in the mighty name of Jesus out <laughs> out in the name of Jesus go go hallelujah I want to pray for favor lift your hands some of you have struggled you have done all you know to do I tell you listen favor is one of the anointings God has blessed us with in this ministry you don't need to you don't need to have eyes to see that what is happening is the favor of God I want to release it upon you father higher shatter Lord, are this not your people? Have you not brought them to favor them? Right now, let the oil of favor from this building right to the end outside. Let the anointing for favor move across this building now. Move across this building now. Take it. Take it. Take it, take it. The favor anointing, shake it, take a lie. Be distinguished. I place a mark upon you. Be distinguished. Now look at me. Lift your hands. Every cycle of late marriages, lift your hands, please. Because that's why some of you are here. There's no need to be ashamed. There are some of you that are supposed to be married. Every cycle, especially for those of you who is not only you. Look at me. Look at me. Come here. Come and sit down here. Leave her. Leave her alone. Come now. Come and sit down here. Just leave her alone. Come and sit down right here and be quiet. You will do it right now of unnecessary noise. Leave her. She will come and sit down. Hallelujah. Lift your hands, please. We have to hurry up. It's past them. I command right now every voice that is speaking against the marital destiny of people here. You are beautiful, but no man will come to ask you out. You are responsible. Right now. Be broken. Be broken. Be broken. I command marriages. Receive it supernatural marriages. Before the end of 2013. For you and your loved ones. I establish it. In the realm of the spirit. Now I pray against accidents. I put a mark. Of protection upon you. No demon power will be able to cause you to die either from accident, sickness, or any act of terrorism in the name of Jesus.
any armed robber or assassin coming to your house or your parents house they will die before they get there any property that has been stolen in your house or in your life I command it to be returned I command it to be returned I command it to be returned everything that has killed your prayer life lift your hands this is where the whole problem starts from everything that has destroyed your world life the passion for the things of the spirit right now that dry bone from the realm of the spirit oh this will come like an impartation my god i pray like a winnowing fork that is uprooting evil i rekindle the fire upon every altar prayer fire prayer fire prayer fire prayer fire word fire word fire word fire word fire prayer fire hallelujah now i want to impart the gift of the spirit please lift your hands for the gifts of the spirit are given to profit with her this will be the final thing i'll do and then we'll take the altar call gifts of the spirit some of you came here especially those who are pastors who came here you mustn't see me to receive on behalf of yourself and your ministries look up it takes humility for the glory of god to grow in your life the anointing can be charismatic it can be attractive but you need to be humble i'm going to pray lift your hands i'm just going to pray in tongues for one minute and there will be a mighty demonstration of the spirit you will need to remove receive it please you will need to receive it i would like to hear the sound of the symbol as i begin i'll just pray in tongues and different if god leaves me i'll mention them but please those outside it will come like a mighty wave this is where the holy ghost finds expression lift your hands Shake it, take it, la ba da ba 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 ba. Shake it, take it. 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 Gifts of healing, take it. Prophetic gifts, take it. Take it. Word of knowledge, take it. Take it. Word of wisdom, take it. Gift of faith, let it fall on you. Gift of faith. Gift of faith. Descending of spirits. Gifts of administration and leadership. Receive it, receive it. Administration, leadership, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. The working of miracles, the working of miracles, take it, take it, take it. Hallelujah. 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 Glory, glory. Now, look at me. All of you have seen the things that God is doing in this place. You have experienced the hand of God in a mighty and an unusual way 
Look at me. There are many of you tonight. God is calling you. Listen. Inside and outside. Some of you have never taken God seriously. He can change your life. You don't have to continue living the way you are. Hallelujah. You have seen what God can do. You can see that Satan is the one behind these things. I'm going to make an altar call right now. There are many of you outside. You came either because you were invited or you were told you would come and see the demonstration of the Spirit. But the Bible says, For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only begotten Son that whosoever believes in Him Many of you have journeyed. Tonight, find rest. Jesus is calling. If you've never given your heart to the Lord, or you have once given your heart to the Lord, but you backslid it because of the cares of the life, of this life, we show you love tonight. Please, everybody stand. This is the greatest miracle. I'm going to count one to ten. I want you to run. No matter how far you are outside, please don't let anybody stop you inside here. I'd like you to run and come and kneel down here. I will just count one to ten. Please don't stay back. One. Start running. Clap for them, everybody. Start running. I didn't say walk. Run. 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 Come and kneel down here. Two. Don't sit back. Three. Thank you. Young and old. Run and come. Four. Run to Jesus. Five. Six. That devil is a liar. Don't wait till ten is counted. No matter how far you are outside, you can run. Don't be ashamed. Seven. Don't lose this opportunity because of your friends. There are some of you seated outside. God wants to give you a new life. My brother, my sister. Eight. There are two more counts and we're out. Nine. Ten. Hallelujah. Now all of you here, thank you for not being ashamed. This is a family. Lift both of your hands high to Jesus Christ. In a way you will never forget. Say this after me. This is not a special number. It's the prayer. The greatest prayer. I want you to shout it. Let the devil hear you say it. Say after me, Lord Jesus. I accept that I'm a sinner. Unable to help myself. But today, I come to you with an open heart. I ask you to forgive me. Cleanse me with your blood. Give me a new beginning. I denounce sin and Satan. I declare, according to your word, that I'm born again. Jesus is Lord of my life. Holy Spirit, come and live in me. The power of sin, the power of Satan is broken in my life from today forward ever backward never in the name of jesus can you celebrate them everybody please look at me thank you so much for making this brilliant decision daddy you can put down your hands up thank you for this decision this is the best decision you would have made now we are going to follow you up get you filled with the holy spirit and teach you certain foundational truths hallelujah you're going to have a special meeting with Pastor Jakes, sir. Okay. On Sunday, hallelujah, Pastor Jakes will not be around tomorrow. He's ministering in the conference. So, Sunday, what time, sir? Four. Please, Sunday, four on the dot. Just be around chapel, just close to the chapel books that there. And Pastor Jakes will come. Follow the ushers, they will have your details and you'll be back. Celebrate them, everybody. I'm 
sorry we are so out of time now you are worshipping with us for the first time please all of you come in and come and stand here we have a prayer for you we are rounding up this is your first time koinonia give them a big big god bless you we love you god brought you no matter where you are please let me pray for you give me the opportunity to speak over your life quickly 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 please there are so many people koinonia keep clapping thank you for coming keep coming thank you mommy keep coming Koinoni, are you seeing what God is doing here? Bring them, bring them, come. Please come, quickly. I have a prayer for you. Don't go without receiving it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you so much for coming. The Lord brought you by His Spirit. This is Koinonia, meeting put together by Eternity Network International. Hallelujah. We are here every Friday celebrating the awesome things that God is doing. How many of you were blessed tonight? I assure you, you will never be the same. Never. You will go back. Your priorities will change. Your values will change. Your passions will change. Hallelujah. We're going to pray for you everyone in this house is anointed and I tell you as we speak over your life receive it in the name of Jesus Christ saints of God stretch your hands as we pray over them prophesy over their lives we call you blessed in the name of Jesus the Lord gives you testimonies you will go back and eat open doors we bless you with a hunger for the Holy Spirit a hunger for the Word of God a hunger for the life of prayer we command financial breakthroughs we command breakthroughs on all sides. The devil has no power over your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. We bless you in the name of Jesus. Thank you for coming. We'd like to see you again and again. We pray that the Lord will bless you.